Also Johnny at JST Arms and JSD Premium 1911. Uh, it's a very nice pistol. I know you guys want to see it. Like a lot of my builds, I use the whole grip. It's got the extended magazine release. It's got the whole grip. It's got chrome uh, chrome screws, chrome trigger. It has a trigger job done. Uh, chrome serrations. Oh, well, I polished them. Polished serrations. And polish top to the muzzle brake, and uh, just standard hammer, uh, high quality parts kit, and uh, also has a flared magwell as well by Wilson Combat. A lot of the parts used in this are Wilson Combat. I can't remember which ones are which, but they're all really good made parts. Very slick and smooth action. Very tight. You can't really wiggle it at all. Not like the Colt. I've had a Colt before. Oh, I got my hands on a Colt before, and compared to this, it's not as good because Colts aren't hand fit. The ones that are hand fit are uh, there's a few Wilson Combat makes them. There's a few others that are really high quality, but they cost high quality, two to three thousand dollars for a 1911. I built this one for under like oh, how much? Around eight, nine hundred bucks. But it's still expensive. But very, very good pistol. So pretty much, pretty much that was my uh, review with the 1911. I didn't really want to come to the range just do a review, but that was pretty much the review. And also I got the Trijicon night sights as well as uh, one of the premium upgrades too. I put to it Trijicon uh, night sights. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Just basic frame, no rail. Uh, there, I, I wanted to make another one, JSD premium uh, tactical 1911 with the rail, but I'm not really much of a rail person for pistol. For, I don't really think you really need it there unless you want a laser or some high speed or a flashlight. But other than that, this is a really good pistol, 1911 JSD Arms Premium.